Give me plus two bow. Reduced attack speed. Ghost dance. Focus and what? Usually click just resubscribe for fifty-eight months. Oh, oh wow. All damage from blast train and artillery ballistic and poison. If I can recombinate that to another one. Damn! Man, I'm kinda tempted. Honestly kinda tempted to make a new character just for it. This is nice, I'm gonna want a TR Pathfinder no matter what. It's OP, Noogie says. All damage from blast train and artillery ballista. Artillery ballista is just like the normal shitter thing, right? No way, is that the one that shoots into the air? I'm thinking shrapnel. Huh. Okay, let's say we make another Pathfinder. I am not the totem. The totem is not me. Poisons you inflict during any fast effect have 20% chance to deal 100% more damage. I could do that with Blast Train though. That would have a 45% chance. Poison kills count, yeah, but not while they're doing damage. Blast Train would work with that though, and it would prolif. There would be 45% chance to deal 100% more damage. Let's do some rough casual PO being. Wilmus would be sick with this, but I don't have one. Oh my god, Wilmus would be so good, it solves the entire problem of Ancestral Bond. Oh, that would be so good. Dude, Wilmus is sick for this. Um, okay, you know what? I don't even want to look at Fizz. I think Ellie is probably the way to go. I don't even know if this is calculating everything correct, though. Yeah, okay, this is kind of crazy damage. But this is crazy build. Oh, Rain of Splinters. Shit. That would be cool. And full Awakened Gems. Are you guys ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Let us buy the ants. Please close the pierce. Need a pierce? Oh, Effie Casey. Alright, that'll do. Oh, second win maybe? Okay, I hope it's good. I'm excited. It just sounds so fun. I just really want to do it. It's also like, honestly, low key, one of the main reasons why I think re-leveling is a really good idea right now. I'm pretty sure this league mechanic is buffed soon, so I don't want to die to it on my f***ing high level main character. You feel me? I feel like that's fair. Swift and silent Cicerin. Balaista. Maybe I should do Balsida. I should have called it Balsida because um, on the on the tree it actually says Balsida. It's a typo in game. It's kind of unacceptable. How are we supposed to play a game with typos? I want to riot. When was the last time you died in act? Uh, last thing. I um I wasn't looking at my screen and uh, died with all our leveling gear and bros in Submerged Passage. <laughs> Other than that, two leagues before that, uh, Dodri was bugged and had no attack animation and awakened multi-strike on her slam ability. I died to that while leveling. That was fun. How are your wife and kid doing? Um, I don't know. I assume they're doing well. I cannot see them right now, so I'm just, I'm hoping. The cat could have taken them both out at this point. I, I just assume they're good. Loki would never. A wild animal, you never know. He can open doors now on his own. I just unlocked a new fair. Cause like, uh, and like the toilet. Well, I'm more worried about him like running on the stream naked or something after a shower. Cause the shower is one door in. So if she's not looking after him, he just sprints in here. I don't want that to be my first fun reason. Sad. He can open doors on his own now. It's all ogre. Oh 
got a weapon! Do you want to show them your weapon? Oh yeah. Uh, let's do a test run. I have no idea if this is going to be good or not. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. I hate playing trash builds. Okay, it looks like it shreds way harder than... Wait, it looks like way shreddier. My mana is gone. Oh, I have mana issues already. Humiliation. Um, I might have to use life tap. Okay, that looks absolutely fucking crazy. We'll test it on the boss, I guess. Right, let's do life tap for now. You don't need Harold of Agni though. Can you explain why I don't need Harold of Agni? I can take that off. Can you explain why? I think you're just misunderstanding the Crucible Tree. Still need chance to poison. All your damage can poison. Yep. That's not the case, dude. You're misunderstanding the tree. Still need 100% chance to poison. Not will. Can. All right. I also only have 95% chance to poison. So I do need 5% more. But I can get... I can fix that later. Still need poison chance, I'm afraid. Right. I'm excited. Okay, let's go try some bosses. I'm also like super slow attack speed right now. Because I, I don't have a suffix. What's the timer on the right? How old this character is. You know, I do have like that 40% AoE thing I have. I wonder if that'll be good for bosses. I have 40% AoE if I haven't killed recently. Um, I think we have too much damage. So I think I will run... Do I have... No, I don't have enough strength for the term. I think I ditch Malevolence and run Grace. 95% poison chance. Wait, this looks kind of cracked. I love it. I love it already. Proof of concept achieved. And the pro lives. Looks very good. Well, we gotta see what it looks like on my like, Uber bosses, but as a starter thing, it feels pretty fun to play right now. <laughs> All right, let's see how this goes. Man, it's gonna be fun on Ubers. Brrr. If you wanna play hardcore SSF, you wanna be at the stage in Path of Exile where you realize how strong jewels and flasks are. Because like the number one thing as a new player is they don't use jewels, they don't use flasks. And if you don't know why jewels and flasks are strong, you probably shouldn't be on hardcore SSF. That's like a good good tip, I think. Jewels are padding. Well, that's that can be true though, Medicaid. Like a lot of people do like use four such jewels that people aren't gonna get. But when when trees have access to really good jewels and they're using one set jewels, that's like really bad. Like three set jewels are pretty reasonable to get. Right, this thing is super tanky. So this is a good damage test. I'm gonna pop my Val Haste on it.
Okay, I just died, Rip. Oh man, I'm doing so much damage, I'm killing people in chat. No, but he is super tanky, to be fair. Like, honestly, that boss really should get a HP nerf. Because there's sometimes you get there on a build and you feel like you're doing reasonable amounts of damage. You get to that boss and you're like, what the f is going on here? Aren't you super over leveled? Not more than normal. I usually level to 70 in Blood Aqueduct and then continue. I always do that on Hardcore. Then you can put on lots of gear. To be fair though, like, I, I think it's like. I think it is like stupid that people are like saying that Path of Exile isn't accessible. They even added like Delirium specifically as a f you to people that aren't colorblind. Because like GGD or Path of Exile's had issues with like people being colorblind, but in Delirium nobody could see anything. It was just gray upon gray. So everybody was like, well, it doesn't matter what kind of like vision disability you had, couldn't see shit no matter who you were. That's very inclusive. That's true equality. Everybody's fucked. Never seen anything like it. The great equalizer. Arise! I love that little splat. <sighs> now I'm fucked on res though. Well, I'm not fucked on res, but it's a little more low. A what is played? A six hours. It was pretty slow. Mm. But now we have two characters and maps. Poggies.